Buenos dias mga kasangkayan! Welcome back to my channel! So ang content natin ngayon ay isang random activities lang at mag-install tayo ng sensor para sa storage tank. Pero kung bago yan, kung nagustuhan mo ang aking video, please consider to subscribe and don't forget to click the notification icon para updated ka sa susunod kong mga video i-upload. Sana may nakuha kayong idea dito sa ating content ngayon. Dahil dito sa aking channel, Lamang ang may alam. Mag-install tayo ng sensor instrument para sa storage tank. Anyway, partial installation lang muna after that we completely install at instruments required for this system. I explain ko one by one, it's of components and functions. Your bolt, that bolt washer. A pressure sensor or sensors are used to continuously monitor the level of storage tanks in the beverage industry. As the pressure sensors comes into contact with the product it must be suitable for stringent hygiene requirements. Sensor it is also called known as point level sensors, often called switches detect water presence or absence, kung saan nakakonektado sa isang parte ng tanke. The purpose of water sensor is to detect the presence of water and when placed in location where water should not be present or magkakaroon ng tagas or leakage, ang isang tangke maaring nakakonekta sa isang wifi or panel to send an alarm and notify. Sa parting ito ay explain to my crew kung paano magwo-work ang isang sensor dahil ito ay may nakakonektang floating valve at kung paano mag-react ang sensor in case the water reduce into lower level or may mga pagtagas or leak na magaganap if in case. Before we proceed, ano nga ba ang level sensors? Dahil ito ay magkaiba sa tinatawag na water sensor, ang level sensor is a device kung saan denisenyo para mag-monitor or pag in other terms, at pagsusukat ng isang liquid na pagkaminsan maaring mag-measures ng solid level. Once the liquid level is detected, the sensor converts the perceived data into an electric signal. Dito sa isang parte ng storage tank kung saan nag-install tayo ng water sensor meron ding isang instrumento kung saan ang layunin ay to keep an eye your water level. Ang sistemang ito ay automatically control pumps and other devices to reliable control level ang tawag sa instruments na ito ay water level control system. Merong dalawang uri ng sensors, una ang detect sensors a sensor that can convert a noon electrical stimulus into an electrical signal with an intermediate stage, example thermocouple ito ay mula sa temperatura convert to voltage, pangalawa, indirect sensor a sensor that has multiple conversion steps to transform the measured signal into electrical signal. There are lots of types of sensor which usually used for and five basic types of sensor as well commercially used water level indicator, first captive, second ultrasonic, third frequency guided wave, fourth GWR, lastly pressure transducers, each of these commonly used indicators have benefits and each has its drawbacks. Drawbacks na ang ibig sabihin ay converter to identify either locate. The main or key advantage if you are using sensor it's include improved sensitivity during data capture, almost lossless transmission and containers, real-time analysis, real-time feedback, and data analytics services and ensure that processes are active and executed optimally. 
Ito yung advantages ng mga latest technology di na kailangan suriin ng paisa-isa or manually and less manpower ang magagamit ang kailangan lang panel, cable and monitor. May dalawang pinakamahalaga requirements for using sensor. The basic requirements of sensor are range. It indicates the limit of the input in which it can vary. In case of temperature measurement, ensure the thermocouple has range and accuracy. The degree of exactness between actual measurements and true value. Ang karugtong ng video na ito ay ang kabuoang installation ng buong system lahat ng instrumento na naka-installed ay ipapaliwanag ko ang bawat functions. Ito ay isang mahabang proseso. Ipapakita natin ang kabuoan kasama ang storage pipeline na may iba't ibang sensor na nakakabit depending on their process and line of system. Sana may nakuha kayong ideya sa mixing video natin ngayon mga kasangkayan. Kung meron kayong katanungan please drop your comment below at sasagutin natin ayon sa aking eksperyensa at maabot ng aking kaalaman. 0, 0. 16 piece. Boy, yung mga kasangkayan na lang dito na lang. Pero bago yan, maraming salamat sa nakaabot sa dulo ng aking video. Sa muli, gracias, adios.